here, and when Air Force ran this concept, 300% more of the time they won. And what I mean by that is Air Force was 10-3 in 2022, and their three losses, they ran Rocket two times a game, but in their 10 wins, they ran Rocket six times a game. So the lesson is you better make this concept work, and you better run it at least six times a game. So, And they also ran it on an empty. So they stayed in flex. Sometimes they ran it on the spread formation, but then they would put – uh, the B back out wide with his inside foot up on the numbers. He would take three steps up the field and crack the safety. The receiver would block down. The guard and tackle would pull out. They'd block the two widest people that show. Center in the backside would scoop. They would sprint behind the receiver to cancel the adjacent gaps. Backside receiver would cut off. Cadence is down, ready, set, hot. On the Y and ready, the A back would take a big wide 90 degree step, two 135 degree steps, and then sprint at 90 degrees. Quarterback would reverse out and toss in the ball two yards outside the tackle, about a yard outside the receiver, where the A-back would reach for it, run to the sideline, run to the end zone. Rocket's a great play, and it proved in 2022 that it paid massive dividends for Air Force that when they ran it six times a game, they won. And when they ran it two times a game, they lost. So Rocket's proven to be a very effective play. Coaches, you want to win more games in 2023 and get the real-time data that's going to separate you from the rest of the world, give me a call. My number's on the thumbnail of this video. So is my website, Triple Option Football Academy, and Triple Option Football Academy Camps. I'll show you how. We'll talk soon.